Wisset ir heliu. Ich heise Kevin. Hello everyone, my name is Kevin. And this is an episode of Examine That Sentence in Old High German. So essentially we take that sentence from Old High German times and translate that into present day English. Let's do this. Okay, our sentence is from a translation of Tatian's work. Uh, so it's going to be biblical in nature. Uh, well, that's what we're going to deal with. Um, and uh, the dialect we're dealing with is East Franconian. This is around in the 825 AD. And this is from possibly uh, Fulda. All right, so let's get right into it. Where is their manas sun? Where is their manas sun? Okay, what's going on here? Okay, so uh, for those of you who know German, uh, you might notice this right away. You might know notice these right away. So, and if you're going to uh, take a shot in the dark and you are right, this does mean who. Um, normally in texts uh, in grammar books, they would, they'll, they'll represent it like this, or sometimes they do it like this, but uh, for for uh, modernizing purposes to make it easier for us to read today you know I'll, I'll just put it like a, a standard w so so where is their manna sun sun so what what is going on here so we've got who is who is yeah. uh, where is okay so who is uh there uh that is uh the so this is the uh, the and the nominative um case and yes like today uh, like today's german old high german was an inflected language you had nominative accusative uh, genitive dative and instrumental and this is masculine and yes there were three g grammatical genders back then a masculine feminine and neuter so this is the masculine this is the origin of der you know or dea you know but anyway so we got their uh because it's franconian uh <laughs> and then uh, we have mannas here, which is, uh, this is the singular genitive of man. So who is the man's uh, son? And this is, if you were to take a wild guess, boom, you're right. It, it does mean son, as in like a man's uh, um, offspring, if you will. So like male offspring, so a son. Um, why isn't it uh, not sunu? Well, this is a spelling variant, and uh, spelling can vary from... Uh, uh, dialect to dialect, place to place, and even from scribe to scribe, even within the same text, you can have different spellings of the same word. I know that sounds weird, but but wait, what can you do, right? Um, so essentially, the sentence is, uh, "Who is the man's son?" Very simple. I don't want to like pick like a long sentence and then like you know try to do mental gymnastics, you know, to fool you guys. No, I want this to be easy and fun. So where is where is sun? Where is where? Yeah, where is there manas sun? Where uh, who is the man sun? Who is the man sun? You know, very easy. This is gonna be, I, I like how this uh, this first uh, start of the series is going to be easy, and then uh, gradually it's going to get a little more difficult. Uh, well, we'll see. And sometimes I might jump back and forth and whatnot, and. Uh, you know, anyway, 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 uh, thank you for watching. Uh, please subscribe if you're new and please become a patron at my Patreon page down below. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.